Ederson, early crossing from the left hand side. That'll like handball against for Ederson. Emerton, edge of the box, running at Spectre, works it onto the right, tries the shot! And it's a wonderful goal for Press Everton inside the opening two minutes. He beats Spectre on the outside, has whipped it into the top corner. Both defender and goalkeeper look lost, absolutely dumbfounded by a wonderful strike. The perfect start for Rovers. It's two goals in the last two home games for Brett Emerton. Rovers one, Charlton nil. Charlton half clear. Ambrose goes down the line. Two guy picks up. Neil is now in space. Still men forward from the corner. Whipped in. Dick off with a hammer! And Rovers lead by two goals to nil. Less than 18 minutes in. The cross from Neil on the right hand side. Again, the Charlton defence all at sea. And Paul Dickoff gets his third in the last three home games. It's Rovers two, Charlton Athletic nil. Anderson who's in goal for Charlton in place of Dean Kiley. Dean Kiley, the 35 year old, former Republic of Ireland international. He's on the bench, but since breaking the finger in pre-season, in fact, Kiley's not on the bench this afternoon, it's Myra, the reserve goalkeeper. Charlton come forward, inside the area, Hughes is there, and he scrambles the ball over the line. Great flick from Emerton, Reed's now right-hand side, runs down the line, a chance to cross, whips in, good delivery to Pedersen! Deflected, and Rovers have the crucial goal they were looking for. The cross came in from the right hand side, all started with a wonderful flick from Emerson. Reed burst down the line, the low cross in, the Norwegian came in off the flank. Right footed, his shot, took a nick off the defender, beat Anderson, 14 minutes into the second half. It's Rovers 3, Charlton Athletic 1. I think right from the, right from the word go, they've looked hungry to impress and they've certainly done that this afternoon. I think they've made this point before, they've been enjoying playing at Ewood Park, they might enjoy it even more, Bellamy to round off the afternoon! He does do, the free kick flicked on by Kuchi, in clinical fashion, he gets his sixth of the season, low beyond Anderson, right on the stroke of the 90 minutes, Craig Bellamy rounds off a wonderful afternoon for Rovers, it's Rovers 4, Charlton Athletic 1.